But there's a lot that each one of us can do to actually decrease our own exposures to microplastics and nanoplastics, starting with never eating from plastic. Cups and plates like these are all the rage for kiddos. They're adorable and they are slowly poisoning our kids with every single bite. Move to glass, ceramic. Steel is a great option because it's indestructible. Number two, never ever heat plastic. So containers like this shouldn't be going in the microwave or in the dishwasher on heated dry. They shouldn't be left with snacks in them in a car. Instead, let's move to containers like this one. In the kitchen as well, it took me a long time to get rid of my non-stick pans because every little scratch in them is releasing microplastics and nanoplastics into our food and move to steel or cast iron. Trust me, eventually you do get the hang of how to make these non-stick as well. Number three, let's not put plastic on our bodies. So let's be replacing polyester or nylon clothing like this with cotton, linen, and all natural fibers. When we do have to use polyester or nylon, like with swimwear, remember to always hang dry it and never put it in the dryer. So that's it. Never eat from plastic, never heat plastic, and never wear plastic. Those are the three rules.